let's just get this over with right away. No ZR1 in today's video. And I wanna say that this in no way, like the last four uploads, in no way was this my plan to like, oh, I'm gonna drag it out for four days. I'm gonna make a big deal out of it and then finally reveal the car. The idea was I made video number one where the car was on the truck, which it was at the time. And I was like, cool, it'll be here the next day. It's on the truck. I mean, how long does it take to get from Kentucky to PA? It's like a six hour drive, not bad, right? And we had the snowstorm for two days, essentially. Basically roads were shit for two days. So, all right, fair enough, big bummer. You know, I missed out and I was not first. Um, there was a car that was delivered, I think on the following, on that Friday then in a place that didn't have bad weather. I wasn't number one, not the end of the world by any means. And I should have the car on Sunday. Well, apparently they don't deliver cars on Sunday because there are no car sales on Sunday. And I was told Monday today at the latest, Fair enough, you know, okay, the, the original delivery date was screwed up by weather, then Sunday, there's no car sales, and now Monday, here I am, the car certainly will be here at some point, I'm sure. Well, not so fast, because here I waited around all day, you can tell, it's about the end of the day here. Figured I better start filming now, while there is still some daylight. Um, I waited around all day, and I just got the call that the car will not be here until tomorrow. That may or may not be true, because I mean, today was supposed to be a oh, worst case scenario. It'll be delivered Monday evening. Well, it's Monday evening and now tomorrow. I guess words like worst case scenario, and it will definitely be here at this point, because that doesn't really mean anything. And I do want to apologize to all of you because it's a big bummer for me, but I know it's a huge disappointment for you guys because I am inadvertently hyping it up for no reason, because I keep thinking, oh, today's the day, and it's not. To make matters worse, to add insult to my injury and to kick me while I'm down, I gotta deal with, I have to deal with people sending me pictures and messages, DMs all day long of saying, hey, this dealership has one. Hey, this person got theirs. Sadly, I am in fact aware that many people do have their ZR1s and I don't. The only thing I can say to make this a little bit better is that I will still have the first one in the nation, first one in the world with a certain option. This is not like a certain color of stitching on the steering wheel or like brake caliper color. This is a huge mechanical thing. I guess there's that. So for a third time, I am sorry, and I hope that uh, you still love me. Wow, look at that, a stitch cake. That's really about it. You know, unfortunately, I didn't really have anything cool to film today. I didn't have anything lined up, and I didn't even try because I assumed the car was gonna get here, and that would be an awesome video, um, but here I am. So the least I can do is give you guys the info for the call out event, which I'll put the footage from last night's vlog. I'll put that here in a couple minutes. Essentially, our first call out of the season. Now, if you don't know what one of our call outs is, it's a big drag racing event where we invite YouTubers and tons of people to come out and like it's open invite so anybody can show up. You just gotta pay the track, I think it's 20 bucks to enter. And uh, you know, we have, it's a big, it's, it's just a huge show at a drag strip and you can see us race. We're gonna be doing raffles this year that people can enter and you can have a raffle and get a chance to drag race me on track. It can be in my McLaren Corvette the quad, the Duramax, whatever you want to race, for Nick and, and Jack as well. So it should be really fun. It's competitive, but fun. You know, it's not a serious thing. And in the upload from last night, a lot of people asking about many YouTubers that were not mentioned. And just because you didn't hear somebody's name doesn't mean that they're not invited or that we didn't reach out to them. A lot of people are invited. So if you are thinking about somebody, chances are we have talked to them, but we didn't want to put everybody's name in the video because that would take far too long to go over. This should be a great time as it always is. Uh, we've been very successful with these events in the past. People seem to really have a good time. And uh, this year we are introducing a lot of those new features to get people more involved, like the car show that you can enter, drag racing with us, you can pay to enter. By the way, the information for that is youtubecallout.com. Check out the website, you can enter right now. It is first come, first serve, and there are only 50 spots um, per the number of people uh, to be on, allowed to be on track. There are 50 spots. If you wanna pay to drag race with us all day, feel free to check out the website and enter. Yeah, we're doing that, we're doing the car show, we're doing the raffle thing, and uh, we got a couple of other surprises in there as well. I'm looking forward to the call out events almost as much, maybe even more, uh, as I was looking forward to getting my ZR1 delivered. And I know these are like the, it's the biggest first world problem ever. Like, like boo hoo, woe is me. You know, my brand new Corvette didn't get delivered on the day that I wanted it, but um, you know, like you buy a McLaren, 
you can schedule the exact hour when it gets delivered. It's on its own specific truck and it comes whenever you want it, you can schedule it. Whereas with the Corvette, I'm at the mercy of all the other stops. So like my car has been on the truck, but it has to go to a bunch of different dealerships. So it's on there with Stingrays, Grand Sports, Z06s. It's on there with all those other cars. And if they need to be dropped off, like in my case in Pittsburgh, well, the truck goes there, then it comes here. As usual, like with everything else, I get fucked. If the car doesn't show up tomorrow, uh, I will not be making another video and I will have most, you most likely won't ever see another video from me again because I will have jumped off a cliff. Here is the full version of the call out info. Hope you guys enjoyed this upload. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you are stopping in for the first time, please subscribe. Take care. Have a great day. So we are back with another YouTube call out video. Now for our first call out of the season, and I say first because we are going to be doing quite a few and uh, the plan is to travel around, maybe do one in Texas, maybe even California, Florida. Uh, I know we have another one slotted for North Carolina in the coming months. Uh, but for our first one, it is again at Cecil County Dragway in Maryland. All the info will be down below. And uh, it is on April 29th. Uh, doors or gates rather open at 10 a.m. Right? That's right. Yep. And it goes till roughly about 4 or 5 in the afternoon. Now we are going to be inviting a lot of people. And for more information, by the way, check out YouTube call out. Dot com very simple youtube callout.com we also have a car show that you guys can enter we have uh the ability for you guys now it's a first come first serve basis but the ability for people to pay and enter so you can actually drag race with us and we're each going to be doing a raffle so uh, you can enter my raffle nick's jack's raffle and uh, how it works is you get a ticket and then you get to we're going to do a drawing every hour and you get to race one of us you can pick what car you want you want to race nick's 2013 or, you know, if your car isn't that fast, maybe it's 2017. Whatever you want to race, you can pick the car. You can race me on the quad. I don't care. It's going to be awesome. <laughs> the people that I would like to start out by inviting, and again, you might not hear some names here, and the reason is because we are doing the other events, so we want to invite them to those, so it's a, a shorter distance for them to travel. So the people that I'm going to invite here is, number one, Doug DeMuro, pretty local. Doug, we'd love to have you. Bring whatever you want. Uh, the guys from MBT, formerly MBT, Bobby Collins, Jacob Nicely, and of course, Ryan Royce, a.k.a. Pablo Sanchez. Also would love to invite uh, JR Garage with whatever assortment of cars you would like to bring out, and Evan Shanks, uh, the ricer himself. I'm going to be inviting John Dock again this year. Uh, he can come up from North Carolina and bring the Calmero. I'm also going to be uh, inviting back SRT Mush. You finally got your demon, so I'm excited to oh, see that. Be, that. Yeah, that'd I'm that'd excited be, to see it on be. the drag strip. So bring the demon, He's bring the Hellcat. He's trying to that wheelie too, you know? Yeah, so, yeah, we're trying to see Papa Wheelie. So. Absolutely come and bring it down but uh we're gonna invite him uh also going to invite again the two mustang brothers we're gonna do anthony santora uh he's got a very high powered uh s550 i think it's like Stick a thousand horsepower or something like that and then we also have panda uh s550 people know him as panda and he also has another thousand wheel horsepower mustang so both of you guys Inviting you again this year, so hopefully you can make it out. Lastly, to carry this out, we are going to be inviting Autoblog. Autoblog has been promoting his C63 AMG profusely. He's right out of Pittsburgh, so I hope to see you come out, buddy. It's going to be awesome. I'd like to invite out Family Cruising. We had a great time last year, and we want to invite you to bring your Hellcat out again this year, see how it goes down the track. From a diesel perspective, we got to bring Greg A out. Greg's investing in a ridiculous drag truck. I don't know if it's going to be ready, but he should have something to make for some entertaining content. And then lastly, Brian Scott with Pure Function. He's got a really nice 95 Super, so that should make for some enjoyable experiences. Also, we're going to be having, obviously, CSP and RPM will be there as the two main shops, I guess, of the YouTube call out. And uh, some of our friends will also be there that were there last year as well. Earlier in the video, Mike mentioned that there was, a, there was a car show, there was the ability to race us, and there's the ability to sign up to race throughout the day. So if you want to find more information on that, go ahead and type in youtubecallout.com. It's going to direct you to a website that's going to outline all of that information in a nice, clear, and concise fashion. One of the main things about this YouTube callout tour uh, is essentially just bringing you guys in it more. You know, it's not all about us, and one of the reasons why we decided to have you guys uh, be able to race and have you guys be able to be in the car show was obviously just to involve everybody and make it a bigger and more fun uh, yeah, a little bit uh, more event. inclusive yeah. event to, you know we wanted to give people more options to have fun and and that was a lot of the show. feedback that we got last year yes. a lot of people were saying yes. that they had a great time but they would have liked to have been more actively involved and say is it's gonna be really fun because we're gonna be judging so we're gonna have Best of show, worst of show, best American, best import. We have one specifically categories. for you, dude. Most savage. Yeah, most, most savage. savage. Well, yeah, I was unaware of that. Yeah. But evidently, we have that category too. And uh, if for some reason there is horrible weather, which is quite possible in, in our area yeah. of the country, in Maryland, uh, as demonstrated by it snowing today, 
on the second day of spring. Uh, if there is bad weather and the track is undrivable, unusable, there will be a rain date on the weekend of May 12th. One more thing that I would like to add is uh, for people racing, there is a limit of 50 people per the track uh, space. We want to be able to keep cars running all day. So it is first come, first serve. Again, that information is on the website for you to sign up. So if you would like to drag race with us that day, make sure you sign up. Uh, as soon as possible. You do get a guaranteed five runs for your sign up, so it's not like you sign up and then you just completely get forgotten about. Everything is going to be included and you're going to be factored in as part of the day. You guys have it. YouTube Call Out Tour 2018.